Hello everyone, Jeff here with another update to Jazz with the Juju GUI 2.8.0 release. For those unfamiliar, Jazz stands for Juju as a Service, where you're given access to managed Juju controllers across multiple cloud providers, allowing you to focus on modeling your software and not on the Juju infrastructure. Since the last video, there have been two minor and six patch updates resolving some issues that you've brought up to us and added a number of solutions to problems that you've been asking for. First up, we have Direct Deploy. The new Direct Deploy feature allows you to create Juju cards, which you can embed on your own website or blog, and will allow your users to easily add the specified bundle or charm to a new model and then open the deployment flow for them. Here we have one such card. Clicking the button takes us to the deployment flow with the bundle already added to the model. At this point, simply progress through the few steps and you'll have your solution deployed without having to manually add or modify the model pre-deploy. We can't wait to see how you'll take advantage of this feature to reduce friction, getting your users up to speed quickly. After deploying your model, it's common at some point in the future, you'll need to SSH into the various machines, whether it's to pull down a configuration file for kubectl or some debugging. To aid in this, we've added the ability to add SSH keys to your model from within the deployment flow. This new SSH key section is as simple to use as selecting where you'd like to import the keys from and adding your username. Juju will take care of the rest. These keys can then be removed at any time from your user profile or from the Juju CLI. One of the benefits to cloud computing is your ability to custom tailor the machine sizes to your applications. With the updates to the machine view, you can now specify a number of constraints for the machines that you'd like Juju to request from your cloud provider. These constraints are now editable, pre-deploy in the machine view, and shown in the deployment flow. After modeling your applications, you'll often want to review the actions that Juju will perform before hitting the deploy button. Now in the deployment flow, we've merged the two change log lists into a single list, which groups the changes by application and splits out the machine information into their own lists to make it much easier for you to review. For those on Jazz, you are already running the latest GUI. If you've bootstrapped your own controller, you can upgrade to the latest GUI with Juju Upgrade GUI. We welcome any feedback you may have. Uh, you can chat with us in hash juju on irc.freeno.net or you can file issues on our GitHub repository. Thanks for watching.